Well, thousands of fans at Great American Ballpark tonight, but they weren't just there for the game. Yeah, so country music superstar Thomas Rhett did a post-game performance, and part of the money from tickets sold tonight is going toward a great, great cause, only on WLWT. Thomas Rhett's wife talked with our Daisy Kershaw to learn more about all of this. Hi, Daisy. Hi there, Cherie. 40,000 fans filled the stands here, and every single person who bought a ticket to be here tonight is helping to support a life changing cause, one that's very near and dear to Thomas Rhett and his wife, Lauren Akins. Country music star Thomas Rhett transforming the field at Great American Ballpark into his stage tonight. Part of the money raised going to a cause very close to his family's heart. He's like, how can I be a bigger part of this? How can I use what I've been given to let people know about Love One? Rhett's wife, Lauren Akins, is the vice chair of Love One, a nonprofit based in Uganda that helps families there with children battling illness. It was my first trip with Suzanne to Uganda that I met Willa Gray, who is our oldest. The Lord just swung every door open and we became a family and she she is who made me a mommy. Akins works alongside the organization's founder, Suzanne Marnick, who started Love One after adopting her daughter Josie Love. When my husband and I went to pick her up, she was really sick and malnourished. Suzanne was told her daughter had malaria, tuberculosis and HIV. I sat in hospital after hospital holding her, wondering if she was going to live. And I would look around and see other moms with the same hopeless feeling that I had. And that was Suzanne's call to action, helping others get the care her family did. I thought, you know what, Lord, I don't know what I'm really supposed to do with this, but you do. So I started the nonprofit. And now fans here in Cincinnati are helping too. Every time you purchase a ticket, this is the good that you're doing across the world. The money raised tonight will help provide food and medicine for thousands of children. That's all thanks to the fans who showed up. Reporting live from Great American Ballpark, Daisy Kershaw, WLWT News 5. Boy, great, great things.